look at this cows, the streets, how people are crossing the road. It's green. We are going on Howrah Bridge, the historic Howrah Bridge. It's called Robindra Shetu and look at the structure. It's monumental. It's just too big, too high. Howrah Bridge was commissioned in 1943 during British rule in India and was opened to the public on February 3, 1943. It was originally named the New Howrah Bridge, but in 1965, it was renamed Robindra Shetu after the famous Bengali poet Rabindranath Tagore. Look at the Howrah Bridge structure. This is just extraordinary. But while we're on this side of the city, we thought we should drive over this historic Howrah Bridge. I haven't been on this Howrah Bridge for almost probably 20 years now. And so this is very nostalgic and uh, yeah, it's a perfect time. If you're watching and if you're from Kolkata, you should enjoy this and I'm sure you'll enjoy it. The bridge is a cantilever truss bridge, one of the longest of its type in the world. It doesn't have any pylons or towers and it's supported by two main towers at each end. The Howrah Bridge is a vital transportation link serving a gateway to Kolkata from Howrah district. It carries a daily traffic load over 100,000 vehicles and countless pedestrians, making it one of the busiest bridges in the world. We are driving towards the Howrah station. The Howrah station is one of the largest train station in India. It's one of the busiest place in, in Kolkata. And during Durga Puja, it's even busier. On the right hand side is the historic Howrah station building. With these modern time lightings, look at this, it's, it's looking gorgeous. Indian Railways, which was originally developed by British Raj and British government, has a history over 200 years. And look at this police, traffic police as well. He has got some LED on his shoulder. Look at the lighting. Also, there is an old locomotive, look at that, lit up with LEDs. I'm glad that we came this way because we got really good lighting because of Durga Puja and this iconic Howrah station and Howrah bridge. So they have put a lot of lights here. Howrah station, officially known as Howrah Junction, is one of the oldest and largest railway complexes in India. It was established in 1854 and has since played a pivotal role in country's railway history. We live in Hobart city and we have a Darwin River, a very big, very wide river. And we have a Tasman Bridge on that Darwin River. Other side of the river, we have Howrah, a suburb called Howrah. And that's very similar to here as well. We have Kolkata and we cross the Howrah Bridge and the other side is Howrah suburb. So we have very strong similarities in that context. Uh, between Calcutta or Kolkata and Hobart in Tasmania in Australia. Look at the structure. I wish they had put LED lights on this bridge as well. It could have been much better. This is puja time and all these people are basically coming from other district of West Bengal and coming to city to watch all these extraordinary lightings and puja mandops that we have been doing. That's why we have so many people around in this area near the Howrah station because it's a common way of transport is taking a train which is the cheapest way of traveling. structure and the people on the bridge. So many people are walking. Mm -hmm. 
So we took the bridge from Kolkata side to Howrah side. We crossed the Howrah bridge, as you can see now. But we are approaching from other side, from Howrah side now, and we are going on the bridge to cross the river, Hooghly River. And as you can see, all the lights on the bridge now on. So they're coming on. So this is a perfect moment. So we, we can get the lightings on Howrah bridge on our video. I wish it could have been much brighter. <laughs> But still, it looks stunning. The bridge is not just a means of transport, but also a cultural symbol for the people of Kolkata. It has been featured in numerous films, books and songs, becoming an integral part of the city's identity. Look at the scale of the bridge, it's just gigantic. Look at so many cars and the bridge, you'll, you'll understand the actual scale of the bridge. Probably on the video it doesn't do much justice, but it's mammoth. It's an interesting subject for the video anyway, because it's such an iconic, if you look at Kolkata's photo, Howrah Bridge, Victoria Memorial Hall, these are the two iconic structures, all building or structures always come alight and so putting Howrah Bridge and driving on Howrah Bridge in a video is always special.